Hey guys, it's me. I'm back with another 2K24 simulation video, and today I realized that I want to do the top 16 best NBA teams ever and see who was the best NBA team ever. So, first, it means a lot to me because you hit that like and subscribe button, and then we're going to get right into it. With the first game in this video, we have the Lakers trying to sweep out the Pistons. So, um, we're gonna see who's gonna win this. The Lakers with the ball down one. Oh, over to Shaq. Shaq don't hit. Now the Pistons desperately need to score to avoid being swept. It's the 2000 to 2001 Lakers. Pistons call timeout. Pistons trying to pass it in. They pass it in and call another timeout for some reason. I don't know what they're doing. This is a shocking Kobe. Uh, I think Kobe's on this team. He should be. Yeah, Kobe's on this team. It's the Shaq Kobe Lakers. So. This is the only Pistons team in this tournament. There's three Lakers teams, I think. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Uh, whoever that is, he passes it over to Thomas. Thomas tries to. Oh, spins. Goes up. And he hits it. It's a one point game. Lakers down one with 38.3 to go. Fisher taking it down the court. Lakers down one. Pistons need to stop. Trying to stay alive. Lakers trying to close out the series. Oh, to Fox. Fox wide open for three. He missed it. Pistons get the rebound, and the Lakers are going to foul with 22.8 left to go. No shot clock remaining. Edwards, first free throw. It's good. Two-point game. He's trying to make it a three-point game. Edwards, the next free throw. He missed it! Now the Lakers can win the series! But let's see if they go for the two, the three. Let's see if they make a three, make a two, or miss. We'll see. Is this series going to end here? Or the Pistons is going to force game five? Or are we going to overtime? Oh, Kobe! He's got a wide open lane and he dunks it in! It's a tie game! 16.8 to go! Pistons have a chance for the buzzer beater! This is the four seed versus the five seed in the West. Lakers are the four seed, Pistons are the five seed. I did it based on rankings, the most reliable rankings I found online. And every team in the rankings that was in 2K I used. Oh, he passes into Aguirre, Aguirre up! He got it! 0.2 to go! And because there's only 0.2, yeah, he didn't get the shot off. He didn't get the shot off. There's going to be another game. Although it's pretty small, considering they're down three games to one, and the Celtics are at four, going to the line with 9.7 to go. This series looks like it's over, and the Celtics will eliminate the Bulls for the first elimination of the round. This is the... I forgot what Celtics this is. I'll do a recap after every round, just so you know what teams moved on, because it doesn't tell me in the middle of the game which Celtics or which Bulls. There's so many Bulls teams, so many Celtics teams, so many Lakers teams, a bunch of Warriors teams. So we get to both, and it's a six-point ball game. Oh, what a performer this guy is. The Bulls call a timeout. It's, things are looking really grim. Uh, the fastest three they've ever hit in their life. Pass it in, three. They're gonna need Michael Jordan to shoot this, too. Oh, Nine not Michael Jordan. Oh, fourth. Harper's wasting time. Oh, he drives, it's over. He goes up to three. There's only three seconds left. He missed. They're not even gonna foul. Series over. Celtics move on. Down go the Bulls or whatever Bulls team this is, and whatever Celtics team it is. It's the Larry Bird Celtics. For the Lakers here against this Warriors team. This isn't the. This is the 14. No, it's the. It's not the best Warriors team of all time. It's the second best one. I forget which one they are. It's not the one that won the most games in NBA history. But they're going to take down the Lakers, whatever Lakers 
is. I really don't know. It's the Kareem Abdul-Jabbar Lakers. So down they go, and on goes Steph. It's ridiculous how good he used to be. I mean, he's still really good, but he's past his prime. The Lakers, and they're going to take it down the Pistons in five games. So this Lakers team with Shaq and Kobe is moving on. This is the 2000 to 2001 Lakers against the only Pistons team in this tournament. The Pistons are going to go out. And the Lakers, this is one Lakers team that's moving on. One of them already went down. Over to Rodman, Lambeer, free. He missed it. Rebound. And Kobe and Shaq are going to the second round. I mean, the Warriors, sorry, who are the one seed, probably the favorites to win this entire series. I mean, tournament, taking down LeBron and his Cavs, who are the eighth seed in the East. Uh, I think Curry, 97 Curry, 92 Clay, and 90 Draymond is just too much for any team. And so there's a buzzer beater for the Cavs. It doesn't really matter because they're going down. So on goes the one seed, probably the favorite to win this entire thing. They're going to the second round. After five. So he's been changing every possession for the entire game. I swear, I'm being blinded because I keep seeing the yellow switching sides when I'm simming it. So now we have the Spurs. They're up in the series three games to two. They're also up in the game after that dunk by one point with 18 points to go. The Bulls desperately trying to cling on. They won last game by a uh, by like 10 points. So they were able to hold on. But I don't know if they're going to do it this time. I don't know. Because every single possession they're trading is doing it. So let's see if that happens again here. Let's see if they get a buzzer. Are they going to stay alive? Are they going to get the buzzer to stay alive? Or is it not going to get a buzzer? He goes over there. It's foul. It's in one. It's in one. one. They hit the lead with 4 one, 3 to go. And it's a foul. It's a foul. No way. The foul gets fouled. Pippen goes up for it, gets fouled, puts it in. It's an and one. Now Pippen, he's going to shoot it, try to make it a two point game. He will. Spurs call time out. They're going to advance the ball. 4.3 to go. Can the Spurs tie the game, send it to overtime, lose the game, go to game seven, or walk this series off? What's going to happen? Passing it in to Ginobili. Ginobili. Puts up the two. At the buzzer, it's no good. With the ball, up one. Up three games to two in the series. This is game six. LeBron on this seat. Along with James, the other leader, the guys. Boss. LeBron trying to make it a three or a four point game. There's 30 seconds to go. Oh, LeBron gets the screen. He flips it back to Bosch. Bosch up with it. It's no good. Rebound box. Box. Ryan to send this series to seven. Robertson has it. He gets a screen. He's wide open from three. He doesn't shoot it because he's not a three-point shooter. Out to Allen. Back to Ross. Ross to Robinson. To Ross to Allen. To Robertson. Robertson drives. Four seconds on the shot clock. He's going to throw it out. The shot is up. It's no good. But it's... Oh, it's not an offensive rebound. And there's three seconds left. Oh, and they're going to have to foul. They only have four from three to go. LeBron, if he makes both of these, it's a three-point game. He makes the first... Milwaukee has a timeout. Team LeBron, second free throw is good. It's a three point game. The most the Bucks can do now is send it to overtime. What's going to happen? They don't have a three point shooter on their team. Where's Kareem? They're down by three. four seconds left in the fourth. Guys, your thoughts? They should have a play prepared for this scenario. Little time. For three, he barely got it off. It's no good. So down go the box. And on goes Bronze Miami with Wayne Wade. This is a crazy team. They're a really good team. I don't know how long they're going to stay. Probably a while. They also have Ray Allen. So the box in a thriller go down in 16. Smacking the Lakers' freaking butts. In the, the game seven, 2008 Lakers. I mean, 2008 Celtics versus. I don't know what Lakers this is, but the Lakers just got absolutely yes, embarrassed West. in Game 7. Oh my god. I was sitting, and I was listening to music, and then I slow it down once it gets to the fourth quarter. And I saw in the start of the fourth quarter, the Lakers had like 60 points, and they scored 8 points in the first 
Okay, well, Celtics are on the next round. This Lakers team, with this performance, it looks like they're the, the oldest team in 2K. The oldest team. The oldest team is Celtics. Oh, it's an offensive three seven violation. Does it shoot free throws? No. Yeah, I'm not sure. No, I don't think they just get the ball. Okay, so Celtics are the oldest team. The Bulls, one seed in the West, two seed in the overall tournament. Okay, they just caught another time. So they're down one, and somehow Bill Russell, show, he shows why he's 12 ranked. Yeah. Uh, I lost for words because Bill Russell has gotten this team the eighth. 16 seed in this tournament. Two a game set against the two seed. Like what? Pippen, he goes up with it, he scores. In one point game. Now the Bulls have a lead. You know, I'm honestly gonna be like the Celtics lose at the oldest team. The oldest Celtics team. I mean the oldest team in two games. Just go down that this, you can't see my hands, but like you're literally touching my fingers. They were this close. It's gonna be heartbreaking. Okay, it is their ball, and they're only down one. So let's see what happens. Bill Russell gonna work some magic. Jones behind him to Jones. Sanders, Bernie Sanders, Sanders Bill Russell, it's Bill, oh, outside of the three line, if you shoot a three, well, get it to Bill, get it to Bill, Bill, yes, Bill, he got it to Bill, one point game with 4.3 seconds to go in game seven, Celtics score, they're up by one, time out Bulls, the Bulls are going to have to shut up really quick, oh no, I'm not, I think they can do this, Oh, oh, he passes it in, Harper, three, two, to Jordan, Jordan up with it, keep board. Oh my god. No, that, that's it, they're going to have to throw a lot. They lose. You don't have time to get anything off. They actually went all the way here. They, he didn't even get it off in time. He missed it too, oh my god. So... For Celtics fans, that is heartbreaking. The Celtics go down by one point in the game seven. It was the 16 seed versus the two seed, and the Celtics almost got there. But the Bulls, Michael Jordan just went the extra mile. The Bulls are moving on, and the Celtics go down in a wild game. So after the first round, I'm going to start in the East. We have the 2017 Warriors, the one seed in the tournament, taking out the 15 seed 2016 Cavs. And then we have... The three seed Milwaukee, the 71, the 1971 Milwaukee Bucks, and they're gonna lose to the 2013 Miami Heat. They're the seven seed, so they get well, they're not the seven seed, they're the no, they are the seven, right? They should be no, they're not, they're the four, whatever. They're the seven seed in the east. We're just gonna go by east and west. What seed they are, they're the seven seed, they upset the Bucks. And then there's the Lakers and Golden State. Golden State, the five seed, is going to upset the four seed. The Lakers, that's the uh, 1987 Lakers and the 2016 Warriors. And then it's the 1986 Celtics. And they're going to beat the 1998 uh, Bulls. So that's not an upset. So we have the Celtics and the, the Heat facing off in the East. And then the Warriors and the Warriors facing off. I think the seven... I think... 20, uh, 2017 is going to win. Uh, and then we have the one seed, no, the two seed of the entire tournament, which is the one seed in the West, the night, uh, the 96, 1996 Chicago Bulls, and they barely beat the Celtics, the 1965 Celtics, and then it's the 2001 Lakers, they're going to take out the 1989 Pistons. And then San Antonio, 2014, San Antonio Spurs take out the um, three-seeded Bulls, who were 1991. And then the Celtics are going to take out the, the 08 Celtics are going to take out the 71 Lakers in seven games. So this was not an upset, the Celtics Bulls. 
This was not an upset. This was an upset. And this was an upset. A big upset. I wasn't too surprised. Okay. So, yeah. Let's get into the second round. In six games, they're going to take out LeBron and his heat with Dwayne Wade and Ray yeah, Allen. And this is the... Uh, not the 08 Celtics. This is the Larry Bird Celtic. He's guarded closely. Shoot it, please, Ange. Oh, they are gonna shoot it. And he hit it. <laughs> so down go Miami and on to the Eastern Conference Finals. The final four is this Celtic team. Dwayne Wade with 25. And Larry Bird. Lakers down four with the ball. Kobe Bryant. This is the 2001 Lakers. Kobe, he drives. Never mind, he passes it to Fox. Fox passes it back. Kobe, shot is up. It's no good. Rebound. Bowls. The Bulls are looking like they're going to win this series over the Lakers. Which I, not, I don't think it'll be out yet. No, it shouldn't be. So it's not good. And it's a six-point ball. So the one seed in the West, but the two seed in the overall tournament. So the Lakers are going to call timeout. They're down six. They need a three desperately. They do not have a chance at this. There is still 30 seconds left. Really deep, but wide open. He missed. Rebound long way. Jordan gets it. They're fouling. Yeah, this game's over. There's 18.9 to go. It's about to be an eight point game. This is no shot. Jordan misses a free throw. Like I said, no shot. He misses a free throw. 18.9 to go. Yeah, they need. They're done. Here are the Lakers now. So Kobe and Shaq are going to go out. Fox for three. Oh, he got it. It doesn't matter now. Still Oh, but he misses the free throw. Misses. We'll see if he can hit the second. If he misses this, and he's able to hit the second one, and that increases the lead to six. Twelve seconds left in the fourth. Here we go. Fox for three. Fox for three. He missed it. Shot rebound. Out. Fox. Fox. He's up with it again. Is it in? No. Rebound. Shot. He can't put it up. And game is over for the 2001 Lakers fall, and I'll go one seeded West Bulls through the Western Conference Final Five in a game seven. This is the 08 Celtics. This is, I think, the 2014 Spurs. The Tim Duncan, Manu Ginobili, Kawhi. Yeah, this should be the 2014 Spurs. For three, he got it. It's a two point game. Celtics have the ball with a two point lead. Are they fouling on me? What? So Rajon Rondo taking his hand. Oh wait, Celtics versus I'm pretty sure the 2014 Spurs. 25 seconds to go. Here, pass it. Celtics up to him with the ball. Right. Oh, he's got a wide open look. He takes it. No good, but rebound Brown. Brown puts it up and it's good. Spurs call timeout. It's a four-point game with 15.5 to go. For a second, I thought that was Jalen Brown, and then I realized that. Jalen Brown, there was no way he was playing basketball in 2008. He's like not even 30 yet, so that was over almost 20 years ago. And there's the screen. It was 16 Lewis years ago, so he would be like barely. It's hauled in by Garnett, and they're gonna prolong the game. So they're gonna foul the Celtics with six point two to go. This series is over. Ray Allen makes the first. He's gonna make the second too. I bet you. Content or H guarantee. No so Parker, he's just gonna. Extra nails in the so right they actually lost the series. Kawhi for three. At the buzzer, no good. We on Celtic. Celtics win game seven, and they're going to the Western Conference Finals. Uh, the 2017 Lakers versus the 2016 Lakers. In game seven, the 2017 Lakers are gonna win. They're the one seed in this entire tournament. The 16 Lakers are not as high of a seed. They're still a pretty good seed, but not as high. And so 
So I put the sand team makers in orange so that we could see who was who when we came to this. But the 2017 Warriors, probably the favorite to win the entire tournament, are going to move on to the Eastern Conference Finals, to the Final Four. And so down to the 2016 Warriors, they actually put up a fight. I'm surprised they got the game seven. Who are trying to upset the number one seed in the entire tournament. I know they're like one of the best all time. They're like fifth best all time. They're like the four seed or something. But the fact that they're upset, this is like, goes, this goes to the team considered to be the best of all time. Okay. Prime Curry. Prime play. A little bit past his prime. KD. Still like quite in his prime. And, oh my god, this was just him. And almost like a little bit past his prime. Um, Draymond Green. Like, this team is so good. But this other team is like, I don't give a crap. And now they're winning. In a game at six, where they have the series lead, and they're up by two points with 50 seconds to go. Hopefully, this is an entertaining way for the Warriors to go out, or maybe they just don't go out. But I want to see how this ends. McGee, JaVale McGee scores and makes it a one point game of 42 seconds. This should be an interesting one. So get some popcorn, sit back in your seats, and get ready to be really excited. Because I think that the you know, Warriors of the Celtics have something really special in store. A wide open look. Somehow Nick repairs, gets the rebound, puts it back up. It's a three point game. Warriors call timeout. That's the last one. Celtics have one more timeout. Sorry, I'm talking so fast. Okay, so. Jamal McGee, you're gonna pass it. I said Curry, he's really clutch. So. I'll just see, because I saw a thing saying he's just not as good in the postseason. I don't really trust that. It says this is a playoff bracket. I don't know, maybe he's a stats for the globe or something. I don't think so, but if um, Johnson makes both of these, it's a three-point game. He made the first, so it's a two-point game with 24 seconds to go. There's a point one second difference between the shot clock and the answer. game clock. So basically no shot clock. He makes the second, it's a three-point game. I'll just basically say shot clock is off. It kind of is. It's on 0 0.1 second points. It's the smallest difference ever. By the time the shot clock goes off, if there's a shot clock violation, the game clock will be off. And he missed. Curry missed. And 12.3 to go. JaVale McGee's going to foul. Who's at the line? Ainge. Danny Ainge. First free throw good. Up by four. Danny Ainge. And up by four is the Celtics. Sorry. Danny Ainge makes the next one. It's five more games. Couple of to go. They need Curry or Thompson. There's just someone to hit a three right now. They need it so bad. Or KD. KD for three. Really deep. No good. Celtics rebound. This game's over. They're going to Johnson with three points. Having to go. Five point game. Oh my god. The Celtics just upset the one seed. I never thought I'd say that. The Celtics just have seen, uh, the Larry Bird Celtics, 1986 or something. This is upset the 2017 Old State Warriors. Curry doesn't even get a shot off. That's the game. So the Celtics are going to the finals of this tournament. So we have, it's the Bulls and the Celtics. In the other tournament, I'm pretty sure. Wait, never mind. So the Celtics scored in the finals. Larry Bird scored 38. That's very Larry Bird. Curry scored 35. That's pretty Curry. So I'll see you guys in the finals, I think. Because a Celtic Celtics, the 2008 Celtics versus the 1984 Celtics. It's like, I know the Celtics are the best team ever, but like, there's been better seasons. Like, Somehow the Celtics just got hit the Warriors. And now so the two one seeds for each conference were in the conference finals. The two Celtic teams were also in the conference finals. Well one went out of the first round, that's because they were not. They were losing to Russell. Bill Russell was running the entire show. So they couldn't really move on past the seat. They actually got eliminated by the seat. Promise that the Celtics are allowed to win this game. Yes, I'd be surprised if But that's not good because we don't want Celtics Celtics in the finals. That's not entertaining. I want entertainment for you guys. I know I love the Celtics, but I want you guys to have a fun video to watch. And I feel like Celtics Celtics is like... I mean, it's cool in all the teams that Celtics people are. We already know now that 
one of the Celtics teams is the best ball. And of course he's a shooting foul. Like, I, this is the only time I'll ever, ever be using against the Celtics in one of my videos. But, <laughs> but just, I don't really want to see Celtics Celtics. I want to see Celtics versus another team. There's no excitement to it then. Because I don't have a team to root for. You guys don't have a team to root for. I mean, I guess a lot of you are rooting against the Celtics because everyone hates the Celtics. Besides Celtics fans. Jordan. He's probably going to put it up. It's a 10 point game. This game's yeah, I'm parking. They're not even gonna the foul at this rate. Like, it's so bad. Ten points, twenty-five to go. Yeah, this game's over. Now here's Rondo. But like, wow. Like, I wasn't Seven expecting two Celtics teams to make it to the finals. I was hoping one would. Six to shoot. I was not hoping here's two would. Like, that was like, that was, that's like overkill. That's like uh, wishing for too much. Jordan the pass to Rodman. Jordan to Rodman. He dishes it to Pippen. To Pippen to Rodman. Jordan, Jordan. Jordan for three. Missed it, rebound Celtics, and the game's over. Bro, come on! I mean, I actually have Celtics Celtics finals. I know they felt the best team ever, but like, ugh. Okay, see you guys in the finals. Heard Michael Jordan and Mary Bird Celtics went up two games to nothing. Now, Kevin Garnett Celtics are the 08 Celtics. They came back and now have won the finals. This is the thing. You could consider Larry Bird Celtics the best team ever. Because Larry Bird, fifth best player, fifth best player, something like that. He's in the top seven best players ever. Kevin Garnett, top 15 if you really like him. Probably top 20 if you don't. But, like, okay, he's the free. But, like, I feel like you could consider Larry Bird Celtics to be more iconic. Like 2008 Celtics, because yes, the 2008 Celtics were the last Celtics team. It's been a long time since the Celtics won the finals, somehow, because they're the best team ever. But, I do feel like Larry Bird Celtics, Larry Bird and his, like, he had depth. Larry Bird was the star, and there were some pretty decent players on his team, that's why he won the finals. But, there's no really super iconic figure on the 2008 Celtics. So you can't really consider them the best team ever. You could consider Larry Bird Celtics the best team ever. I think still, keep, still a lot of people after this video are gonna consider the Warriors the best team ever, the 2017 Warriors. I still think that probably the 2017 Warriors. I hate the Warriors, don't get me wrong. I hate them. I don't like the Warriors, I don't like the Lakers. I have to give them credit. They've won the most games ever. They've won a bunch of finals in a row, in a row up to that. They had KD, prime Steph, prime KD, prime play. That's like ridiculous. That's just water. All of their shots are just water. So, some people could consider the 2008 Celtics are probably like top 10 best teams ever. Larry Bird Celtics, probably top five ever. This shows that no matter if you're the best team ever, that anything can happen in basketball. Huge upset can happen. This team was the seventh seed. They beat the two seed. They beat the one seed. They beat the other Celtics. They beat, they beat the San Antonio Spurs, who were really, really good. But this just goes to show that in basketball, anything can happen. Kevin Garnett scoring 25, Paul Pierce scoring 24. Look, Larry probably scored over 30. Yeah, 33. Larry Bird, Robert Parrish, and Kevin McHale. You don't know anyone else probably besides maybe Danny Ainge or Dennis Johnson, but like those are the starting five. You don't know any other bench players. Like you probably know Rajon Rondo. Sam Cassell, because he's now their coach. Uh, Ray Allen, Paul Pierce, Kendrick Perkins. Like, you know these guys. And, like, but I wouldn't say because of this simulation that the 08 Celtics are the best team ever. I say other people, you can learn from this video, and either you can go do one by yourself and see what would happen then or you can believe what you see here
Or you can go watch another video, because there are a lot of videos on YouTube that is this is the same idea. This is not my original idea. I saw a YouTube video of this, and I was like, hmm, let's do this. So, I'm going to give credit to Halftime Productions here. Shout out to Halftime. Uh, another Celtic fan, just like me, makes YouTube videos. Uh, I watch a lot of his videos. He's really good, fun to watch. He does it better than me. That's because he's been doing it for a long time, and he hasn't just, like... He's more serious about it. It's like a career for him. This is just a way for me to have fun and let other people enjoy it with me. But shout out to him. So, what would happen? Who is the best all-time team ever? That question? If you listen to 2K, which is not always right, and anything can happen in basketball, it's the 08 Celtics. But, it really matters on your opinion. See, I would probably say it is the Golden State Warriors. Like, probably. Most people would say definitely the 17 Warriors. I would say probably because I don't like the 17 Warriors. I don't like the Warriors in general. So, it really just depends on your opinion. And so, listen to yourself. Okay, I'm not trying to turn this into a therapist session. Thank you guys for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons. Please uh, put notifications on so you know anytime I upload these videos. And thanks for watching. See you guys in the next episode of 2K Simulations.